I am a, a Japanese male. <laughs> I'm a Jamaican. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today is a coffee chatter sit down with you. This is coffee chatter episode number nine and guess what today is? Today is my birthday party. Yes. Okay, so go grab your Cup of Joe, move me back here, and we'll start this chatter, shall we? All right, so like I said, today is my birthday. I am leveling up, and when I say I'm leveling up, people look at me like I'm weird, and I am. <laughs> but I think of birthdays as levels. And I'll kind of touch on that in a little bit, um, but I am leveling up today and I wanted to share some of my birthday facts um, today's, in today's coffee chatter. So I was born September 29th, 1987. I'm giving away my age or my level, but I was, according to this, I'm going by mybirthdayninja.com. And it says September 29th, 1987 was a Tuesday. So I was born on a Tuesday. I'm not sure on um, my birth story because uh, it wasn't ever told to me. So I don't know like how much I weighed or how long I was or any of that stuff. Um, I do know that my dad said that I was coming in the elevator on the way up to labor and delivery. So, you know, I couldn't wait no longer. I was coming. So I do know that. So another cool fact, it says that there have been 11,688 days from the day you were born up till today. If you've been sleeping eight hours daily since birth, then you have slept a total of 3,894 days or 10.66 years. You spent 33% of your life sleeping. Wow. There were precisely 396 full moons after you were born. Um, and the next full moon you will see is October 13th. According to this, I'm 159 dog years old today. So it says that my birthday um, is 92987, which reveals your life path as a number nine. It represents selflessness, forgiveness, and creativity. You are the humanitarian, humanitarian. Um, and are deeply concerned about the state of the world. It says the Western Zodiac or sun sign of the person born on September 29th is a Libra, the scales, a cardinal, a cardinal sign with air is my element, the ruling planet of Venus, the planet of love and beauty. According to the ancient art of Chinese, the rabbit, the mystical animal, is my mystical animal. Um, and fire is my eastern element. Sapphire is my birthstone, which I already knew that. Um, and my gemstone is chrysolite. It says that my birth flower is an aster. Oh, it says fun fact. The world population in the year you were born is 5 billion, 27 million, 200,492. Ooh, that's a big number. Oh, it says on the day of my birth, didn't we almost have it all by Whitney Houston was the number one song. Bitch, let's play that. Oh yeah, get it, Wendy. All right, so yeah, that's a cool song. I always uh, liked Whitney Houston, but you know. Um, it says, oh, <laughs> according to this, my past life, 
Uh, I was a male. Somewhere born around Japan in 1775, I was a sailor and a shoemaker. What? Ah, uh, yeah. I am a, a Japanese male. <laughs> I'm a Jamaican. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, <laughs> So yeah, it says that I'm um, a Japanese male sailor shoemaker in my past life. So there. Um, says a brief profile of my past life. You're always involved with all new things. You have always loved changes, especially in art, music, and cooking. Lessons that your past life brought to present your lesson to learn to learn discretion and reasons okay, to learn discretion and reason and then teach others to do that your life will be happier when you help those who lack reasoning okay the estimated number of babies born on September 29th 1987 is 379,976 that's how many people I share my birthday with Oh my. 379,976. Woo! Yes. It says the most popular baby name for a girl on September 29th, 1987 is Jessica, which is so weird because that's my sister's name who was born six years and six days before me. So that's weird. Um, it says for boys, it's Michael. So just for fun, I looked up my sister's birthday because of the last, um, clip that I showed you. Um, so my sister in her past life was also in 1700s and she was also a male and also a sailor and shoemaker. So that's interesting. Where does it say? Okay. So. Oh my God, listen to this. So her top names um, on her birthday was Jennifer and her boy name was Michael as well. So we both have Michaels. Okay, so we went through some fun facts about my birthday, but now I'm going to share with you guys um, why I call it leveling up. Okay, so I call it leveling up because I think every year that you are here on earth, it's a new level. It comes with new obstacles. It comes with new lessons. It comes with new memories. It comes with new experiences. It comes with a, a whole shitload of growth. It comes with um, pain and hurt, but happiness and joy. And it's like a whole different level than what you just came from. Um, so with each birthday, I like to view it as you are leveling up. You're going to a different level, different experiences. And, um, yeah, so with every year is a new level for you. So in the comments down below, I'd love to know what level you are on. Um, and if you could go back to any other level, what level would that be? And if you can jump ahead to a certain level, which level would you jump ahead to? Okay guys, I really enjoyed our coffee chatter this morning on my birthday. I hope you guys have a wonderful Sunday and enjoy the last two days of September because it starts um, October on Tuesday. Um, I'd love it if you would hit that subscribe button down below and join my family here on YouTube. Uh, make sure you leave that comment hit that thumbs up, share this with your friends. Tell me if you have anybody that you know that shares a birthday with me. And enjoy your week. Bye guys. Happy birthday to you.